The old St. Elizabeth Hospital in Hannibal is nearly 100 years old, and after nearly two decades of sitting empty, it could finally be coming down. But there is a long road ahead before the demolition can even start. WGEM's Gianni Peterson has an update on the status of the land. So Gianni, what's going on? Daniel and Raja, back in April, the city approved the measure to move forward with the demolition of the old hospital. But there wasn't any real plans for how it would happen. The historic landmark hasn't been occupied in nearly 20 years since then. Multiple contractors have tried to repair the building, but nothing has happened because fixing the building would cost upwards of $30 million. However, once the building is taken down, the city has big plans. One of the things that we're looking at is an all-inclusive park, uh, like handicap. Uh, accessible and all that kind of stuff with it with this piece of property so it'd be an outdoor park and possibly with an indoor with a building that's set up for indoor stuff. The process for getting the demolition done could take up to a year to find the correct partner. For history fans out there the city intends to reuse some of the historical artifacts from the hospital that could be refurbished. Daniel? All right, thanks Gianni. The city also intends to repurpose the parking lot as well.